for Thanksgiving. I don't really know how I feel about it. Flight's at 5 a.m. Home is kind of weird these days because I don't even live in the same town anymore. My house sold while I've been at college. Overall, nothing is the same, so that makes it feel a little weird. Hey, Mommy. Hey. How are you? I'm doing laundry right now. Wow. And then I still have to pack. And I'm probably not going to sleep because we have to leave at like 3. My flight number, I don't know how to find it. Well, you'll need it tomorrow to fly out. Why? <laughs> how will you know what plane to get on? I just look for the gate. What are you looking at um, for the gate? My ticket? That's what I'm talking about. Where's your ticket? Oh. Um, you should have your flight number on it. Okay, flight number 1148. So I'll, I'll meet you there. Yeah. Okay, alright, be careful, I love you. Love you too. Alright, bye-bye. Bye. Do you know where Preta Maker is? No. <laughs> <laughs> it says that's where it's making us up. I'm showing you guys for the entire time. I know. I used to. Yeah, when I look back, I was like, laughing. this one's amazing. Uh, Wait, what? Wait, what? Back in Charlotte. What do you have to say about being back in Charlotte? Oh, we're back. We're back in. That's what I have to say. Hey. We're back in. Back. Good morning. Welcome to my car. So, I don't know, things are just a little bit off, as is the theme of the trip. I did my makeup and stuff. Something is just, I don't know what it is. I mean, it looks fine right now, but when I did it, I was just like, ugh. Today I'm gonna do a bunch of stuff that I used to do when I was at home. I'm in North Carolina, Charlotte. I don't know if I said that. I'm gonna go get food from Bojangles, because there's no Bojangles in New York. And I miss it. So I'm just going to do a bunch of stuff that I used to do. And, you know, for the sake of nostalgia. Okay. What can I get for you? Hi, can I get... Olivia. Yeah, that's it. Okay, thank you. Okay. Success. I haven't driven in like three months and I was driving last night and I was like, ugh, I do not feel qualified to be driving right now. 
I got kids meal because I can never finish the adult size. I don't know. And it's cheaper. This was less than five bucks. I came to a sad realization last night because I was getting ready for bed and all my stuff was in a suitcase. I was like, dang, I'm never gonna live at home again. Every time I come home, it's always gonna be with a suitcase. And that's just so weird and like sad kinda. It's weird that home feels like a vacation. Like I feel like I'm not, I don't know. You know, New York doesn't quite feel like home either. Like, yeah, I live there and I go to school there and everything, but it's not my home, you know? It's just like a weird little life that I live. It's weird coming back because everything is the same. You know, it all looks the same but nothing feels the same. It's not necessarily a bad thing, the way I'm feeling, just different. I think I'm also gonna take a trip to my favorite thrift store. Okay, I'm back, haul time. Okay, first thing I got, little quarter sleeve, little top, the cute print on it. The next thing I got was this little sweater vest thing. Can you see the details? It's like embroidered. I hope I can show these right. Okay, they're like little trousers. Look at the belt. They just look like this. So I spent $8 total. I feel like I have a tendency to always look back at the past and miss the past and wish I was still in the past but this might be cliche but things are boring when they stay the same you know you need variety and change and you know that's evidence that you're growing and living and getting older and having new experiences so maybe it's not such a bad thing that nothing stays the same or nothing feels the same because you know when I really think about it I wouldn't want to go back you know no one wants to stay the same forever that's so boring so I don't know, change is weird and uncomfortable, but I think that's just it. It's just weird and uncomfortable, but it's okay. I'm back home, and I'm like a new person this time, you know? It's not the old me. I've, I've grown and had new experiences, and now I see things from a lens with those experiences in the back of my mind, you know what I mean? It's like I get to see the same stuff in a new light. As much as it's weird, I kind of like it.